throughout the stretch, you guys have been a hard team to play against, and you've played outstanding team defense. Today, maybe just not quite to the level you expected? Yeah, I mean, that group played as hard as we've played in a in a while, and, you know, obviously we've, we made some mistakes, uh, um, some turnovers and some mistakes defensively for sure. Um, uh, but, you know, we still had, gave ourselves an opportunity at the end and liked the way that we um, kept competing, that's for sure. Were those mistakes breakdowns, Dean, or were they a byproduct of trying to play catch-up and take risks to close yeah. the gap? Well, not, not really. I mean, obviously, uh, you know, we, we had a couple turnovers uh, in different areas, but, uh, you know, the power play, we can't... Uh, we can't give one up there. That obviously hurt, but um, but no, we uh, you know uh, yeah. There's there's certain areas and, and stuff that we can clean up for uh, for our game for sure. Just how, how much of a, I know how much you guys have sort of done well entering the offensive zone with entry with possession. Um, how much is the fine line though sometimes of just dumping the puck and not trying to skate through yeah. a bunch of bodies? They've uh, they've they've uh, committed to their their system. They've got uh, they've got a lot of people back. Um, and it's tough once you dump that puck in. They've got people waiting, um, you know, back by their net. So it's it's difficult to retrieve some pucks. We thought early we did some good things with our entries, um, but uh, but you're right. When you're not getting in, you uh, um, you know we have to commit to pounding the puck in and and getting after it and uh, winning those battles. And we didn't do enough of that. Usually you like to get momentum from your power play, obviously, but you have a couple turnovers that turn into goals there. Uh, you know, what did you see during that sequence, and how did you think your team responded as to things unraveled a little bit uh, in the second period? Yeah, there? no, we thought we responded well after that. Like when we came back out, uh, you know, we thought the group uh, were, were committed starting the third period and, and you know, um, regrouped and stuck together. So, I mean, we we're happy with that. But you're right. I mean, it, it, took, uh, it took some life out of us, obviously. Um, you know, uh, giving up a goal in the power play always, always sags your group a little bit. Is this the perfect situation where you just flush it with another game tomorrow and just the urgency of the playoff race? Yeah, well, we've talked, as you know, it just uh, this game's gone. Uh, we we spoke to the group uh, briefly after and just said that we're, uh, um, you know, one game at a time. This one's gone. Um, we're preparing for tomorrow night, and uh, we'll get ready to do that. Could that be an opportunity to get Devin back in there tomorrow? Do you think? Yeah. Yeah. You expect Eric Stahl? Is he not going to come at all? No. Um, you know, obviously you don't want to make sloppy mistakes. You know, a couple bad changes and stuff like that. But you take maybe some solace in the fact that they're things that are easily correctable going into tomorrow. Yeah, I think so. I think we're, uh, you know, we'll we'll make some adjustments. We'll uh, um, we'll learn from it. Uh, you know, things have been been going pretty well for us. So it's a it's a good opportunity for. Um, us to learn from adverse uh, situations and we'll uh, we'll do that and we'll go forward